Hello, my name is Jennifer, and welcome to part 54 of my Regs to Riches Discover University edition. And if you are returning, welcome back. And it's been a while since we've been playing with this family. I essentially took some time off because I was trying to figure out the impact of both the game update from earlier this month and eco lifestyle before I came back into the save. And it is actually almost over and we're kind of waiting for the results for both Noah and Lola for their recent terms that they've just done. They had exams today and of course Lola was actually on probation. And she was able to get back in and re-register, but I'm just curious what the impact is going to be when we've like had her work hard and do all of her stuff, how she's going to do. And if she, she doesn't do well with it, then we will just have her, I, I was thinking probably I was going to see how it works to try and switch universities and if that will like get things back in, uh, working properly but it's just more and looks like someone's playing in the garbage over there uh, and that and then then they go and pick it up and put it away probably because i have a club gathering saying to do that so anyways now she's gonna go take it out i do have the reduce and recycle trait on so we're gonna have to keep an eye on the garbage uh noah needed i believe he maybe needed some fun when he came home or i don't remember maybe i got some of it back but I thought I would have him. So she's done well. But she is, is grungy. I had tried to get her to scrubber herself. But then she went to go to class. And I didn't want it to interfere. So I, I canceled that. Uh, so why don't we come here and scrubber herself. There we go. And I've been noticing that all three of them when they went to class today, that this little icon here about going to class, it stayed there the whole time. But she is done with her class. For her, it's her first day of her third degree <laughs> that she's doing here. And because she's, I'm trying, I was trying to see whether she'd get through it quickly, but it's just her first day. She's taking four courses a term, which would mean if she did that, she would get through it in two weeks because she only needs to do eight credits. So what I want to do is I want to reset her just to get that going to class out of there. And I did put her over onto this eco innovator. She, uh, she has five influence points, but she needs 10 to be able to vote. Uh, let's see how many, she only has eight. So let's see if there's anyone around that we could come and, and say hello to. It's Manu. We already know Manu, but we'll do a heartfelt compliment. I was trying to see if we could know some, like actually <laughs> someone we knew, someone we didn't know, actually not someone we knew. Uh, and I noticed that for some reason, she had a little bit of pink with Mauricio. I think Mauricio has a trait where he like flirts with because he always has girlfriends and stuff coming over so i'm guessing he must have initiated something which then unfortunately so didn't help her with her influence points and we don't have a lot of time we need to get them because you only have till six to vote i do have the neighborhood voting off uh, or the npc voting off i should say do we know her oh good we don't let's go do a triple introduction and maybe that will get us the points the other two have their points so they can do their voting but let's just Murder try with Chester. Dora. Yes, we don't have much time to get that voting in. Because we're good to get it. Not that it matters. But it's good to get it like one that lets you get influence points just from like doing things. So you don't have to go and introduce yourself to people and stuff like that. I find these first ones when you don't have a neighborhood action plan. And going, there we go. We got lots of points that way. So that's good. So I'm going to just pause it because we don't actually have a lot of time. So let's get... Noah. Oh, I don't know if they're going to all get it in. <laughs> uh, and is she finished? She was doing some... She, Lola, was doing some... No, see, they're going to get their exams. Maybe we'll just concentrate on Dora doing it. Forget this, forget this, forget this. Get home, Dora, <laughs> and try and vote. Uh, and our bills are really, really low because right now the uh, bills are don't really take into account your lot value like it caps at 300 simoleons which is calculated off of 20,000 simoleons so their houses were a lot more than that but their bills are like piddly and of course because I just started playing in like with Saturday night so they haven't had a week of energy and whatnot calculating in there so let's come here and see if she can get here in time to vote on this plan at least we can get one action plan in place from her 
Uh, the others, you know, well, they didn't. And I did give the house a bit of a renovation in terms of trying to make it more eco-friendly. Okay, so we definitely don't want... Uh, my favorite one to start with, to be honest, is the self-sufficiency where fishing gardening and handiness because we tend to do a lot of gardening and some handiness we do that too we're going to probably be upgrading things and much as we're going to upgrade we're going to try and get our appliances eco-friendly it makes more sense to me to start with this where just the actual act of upgrading it is going to help us so we're going to do self-sufficiency is what we will add and we'll have her vote on it so that uh, will get it in so she should have registered that which it doesn't look like she has there we go she did good good i doubt we can sell anything on our bills which we can we can look at in a minute <laughs> uh let's come here and see if you can vote yourself i don't know that you'll get here in time I'm just thinking we're sort of against uh, the timer because of the fact that um, I'll just go. I would hope that it would still count as owning the earning the degree <laughs> if it came up. Uh, I don't think he's going to get there in time. I don't think it's worth it. It's not worth the few points. And he's not, it's not like he's going to become a civil designer or anything like that anytime soon. So we'll just put it back over onto his academic. So, and we'll see if we get our exam results or his, his results for the term. And there we go. We got it. So she, oh, so she is, uh, so we did get the self-sufficiency. Uh, she got A plus for everything and... So now she was an F, and so now she's a C plus for her term a GPA. So, and he got uh, A because I think he had a bad class the last term because he essentially pretty much missed his exam because he wouldn't go. There was issues with him going. So, oh well, A is still pretty good. And he got A plus with everything for this one. And yes, we may as well have her sign up since she seems to be able to continue with it. And she has three classes to graduate. So we'll just do two of those. And then let's see what options she has. Of course, I never went to look and see what she needs in terms of uh, electives. I'm going to have her take programming because I wanted her to work on that skill anyways. I would have had her take it. If they had fabrication, I would have had her take that. But that's not coming up as an option. So we'll do that. And... She got one scholarship. She she has to pay 20 simoleons. Oh, well. It's not like we can't afford it. So, so now we have that. We now only have 24 hours to pay our bills. So we should pay our bills. Because that has changed from how it used to be. You used to have 48 hours before they turn your power off. So I'll have to, like, keep on top of that. Because sometimes, oh, there, his graduation is tomorrow. But I don't know whether he'll actually go to his graduation. It depends on when their classes are when Dora's class is Dora's class is she has three on Monday Wednesday Friday so she only does have one so it's a possibility with her schedule that it would work but Lola she has two classes tomorrow it's likely these two are like like so she covers the morning and Dora covers the evening so or the afternoon so I, I highly doubt he's gonna be able to go to his his um because I've had issues where other sims have classes or especially exams but it probably would apply to classes too so anyways <laughs> she needs some fun so let's get these let her get some fun before she starts doing some work so we're gonna have her play some blick block and she came home she needs some fun too I thought I had you play but maybe I did some other stuff too and that's why you don't have a lot of fun right now but let's Forget about the fun. <laughs> Let's get you do doing your homework. So breeze through your homework. And he should, he needs to get his job, but he got that part of his aspiration done in terms of his academic aspiration. So I'm going to put him back over onto his family aspiration. Super parent. Because we will have him influence, encourage her. So let's come here and help with homework to get her focused. 
And so he has this moodlet here from saving the world from being good because he was doing, I'm guessing, because he was recycling. And so, but he also has the good trait. So I haven't actually played with the good trait because, of course, when I've been playing, I've been giving them some of the new traits. So I haven't played with like this trait right now. So it's interesting to see how it works with that. Uh, I do tend to use good quite often. So we're going to encourage doing her homework. So there's actually renovations in here too. I changed this area. I changed the flooring here to be eco-friendly, but then I realized I didn't know that I wanted the wood floor. I had wood flooring in the kitchen area and I didn't want that because uh, it's now got flammability rating. So I didn't think that was very good to do and I doubt she, so she can't actually do any more homework she's done. So she should do something fun. She can't, there's no point working on that. Let's get her back onto her creativity aspiration and she could go do some drawing downstairs in her, oh no, it's not downstairs, it's upstairs. <laughs> I can familiar where everything is. So she has to draw the five types. So we'll start with people since uh, she doesn't have animal unlocked yet. And let's put this tome away. And how are your needs? You. You, um, and where are you, my dear? Colin, you're playing outside. I had you playing in that. And you kind of need to go potty. Would be good if you get your thinking up to level two. That would be very helpful. You want to play with it. Do we have a tablet? I don't, I don't remember. Oh, yes, you do. You do. Okay. So, someone's made a cake. <laughs> Yeah, I've heard that that's an issue. So Lola, are you have you had enough fun? You do. So why don't you come here and rally the troops? And then you should come here and give him a second wind. Help with needs. Give a second wind. And then he's going to need to go potty and then probably go to bed. Let's check how hungry he is. He needs a little bit, but he can have, he can have a carrot. And maybe an apple. And that'll be good enough. That'll be good. And Dora, you have homework to do. I know what we're going to do. I didn't do this. So we're going to check our bills information is what I thought we would do. Show bills information. So, okay. So our power, we're using more than we've used. Like our rate of change per day is quite high, actually. And one way to actually get this <laughs> is if you change your lot trait here, uh, to either be or, or change one of your lot traits. So I have this is the reduce and recycle. And right now, of course, I have home studio and I have study spot. I did used to have homey, but their skills in the homey things like gardening and cooking, handiness, they're already pretty good. So I figured it didn't really matter. So essentially, it does take away another um, slot. But if you add either like geothermal or it's... um natural well I think is what the other one is then you're more likely to generate more water or power than you have so that makes it easier I do have the um of course I have the walls I've got to put this down I do have these on some of the roofs and some windmills I can't tell that I notice if they really help very much but I have had households where they did but they didn't have the ones on the roof they had the ones that were on the ground uh, and they were able to, but they, they do have a lot of stuff in this house and nothing has been upgraded yet. So that could possibly be why there's an issue. <laughs> so let's have him come here and scrubberoo himself and you, sweet pea, you should go potty and then maybe daddy can read you to sleep or maybe Lola or maybe daddy. Daddy doesn't have any schoolwork to do right now because he is currently not registered in any any degrees so you don't need to have that you are going to rally the troops and we can why don't you you how do you so you're still you're hungry but the rallying the troops will help with that and you got your painting done so put that in your inventory or your picture I should say not your painting if you could <laughs> that would be helpful and now we will draw shapes there you go it looks like we need some more rallying the troops because she's still hungry <laughs> so let's get that let's get that going and <laughs> that's interesting 
I don't remember it being like that before. Maybe they've just changed the picture or maybe it's different. I don't know. Why don't we recycle from inventory and get him to recycle something else? I've already had him recycle a couple of things. I just took stuff like, randomly out of our inventory and recycled it. We'll do one of these. I will have to swap him back over to the correct aspiration, of course. Otherwise, it won't count it. So we want to be on the Master Maker. I did have him reading some fabrication, but I don't think he got very far on it. So maybe he'll go do that. And Dora... What are your, you should do some homework. So we can't do any of that anyways right now. So we're going to do our homework for archaeology. Just anything. Just get your homework done. And you should, my dear, oh, I still had you, I was going to have you clean up, but then I forgot because instead I had you do another picture because you need some fun. <laughs> you know, as happens. So I wonder when his, his, his graduation is. So here we go, 10.32. So that is, oh, I want to get rid of this. I'm never a big fan of that holiday. <laughs> and I often miss it and it gets left on there. <laughs> so I'll get rid of it. And so he's done that. I wonder, I don't know that you can recycle. Can you recycle a cake? <laughs> Let's try it. Let's see if it shows up. Well, you can recycle an apple. So you'd think you could recycle a cake. I don't see it. I do not see it. Oh, there it is. I just missed it. But I scrolled down again when I was looking for what I was actually going to do it. And there indeed it was. So yay. So maybe we'll just have him. He, of course, has his job. And I don't know. We should. I don't know that I'll. I guess I will have to get him a job for him to complete his degree because he needs to get a job with his degree, but he's already maxed his career, which is, I think, what his degree was for. So, <laughs> anyways, so we will come in here and why don't we recycle from inventory one more time just to get it done. Something that I want. So let me look for what I actually want to recycle. No, I don't want to recycle the get better table. And... Oh, we can get rid of the... We don't need the picnic table anymore. We don't have any room here for anything out here. It's all pretty busy and hectic. So he is tired and he needs attention. So can Lola read you to sleep? Bedtime story, Lola. That will help her, your friendship with her and help Lola's parenting skill and give you some attention because I'm pretty sure Lola has claimed you as... Uh, a care dependent oh she hasn't so we will because we need to have that for it to count as a <laughs> as attention for him no wonder i had her give him a bath earlier and that didn't, wouldn't have counted because of that because i didn't have that set up yet so now we do probably because as a baby you don't and so that's probably why so and uh, so she's doing that and then she should probably if she can I've been having problems actually having my Sims read them to sleep, but it seems like it's working here. And I've been having problems with my Sims, um, you know, teaching toddlers. But I was able to get Noah, I believe, to potty train Colin earlier. And, and he stayed there the whole time. He didn't leave. Like, I usually, they start and then they leave and they don't stay. So I'm not really sure. I'm not complaining. It's really kind of nice. I'm just kind of wondering why it's working in this particular save. And I'm having problems in other saves, including saves that were pre-existing saves that the kids were already there and all this stuff. Like, sort of similar situation. I can, so I was surprised, pleasantly surprised to see that it was working. Okay, so you, my dear, need to come here and uh, scrubber yourself. Assuming I didn't already ask you to do that and it didn't fail. But I don't see anything in your little ball there. So I'm guessing you're okay. So your classes are in 11 hours. So for photography and development and public art, private lives. So we'll have to start with those homeworks first. Because those are uh, the ones you need to go to first. And you got that done, Noah? Oh, you, it's registering that you did some of that. So why don't, before we do anything, why don't you come here and produce a new track so you're ready to go. And, oh, I'm not even going to bother trying with the career anyways until after he, he gets his diploma. Because I don't know if it, I mean, I could look and see. It's not like we're going to get the job and see whether the options are there yet. So why don't I try? I'm not going to take a job regardless. And in this save, the nanny leaves. <laughs> in a lot of my saves, the nanny's like, 
permanently there. She never leaves. But, uh, and particularly in my seven toddler one, <laughs> Nanny, I guess there's too much work with seven toddlers. So she used to leave, and now she never seems to leave anymore. Not that I'm complaining, because I've got free services and we don't have to pay there, and usually that's the case. I have free services, but they have free services. As you could see, there was no cost for that. So burn that track, uh, and yet the nanny leaves here. <laughs> so we'll release the track. There we go. And let's check in on Rosie and make sure Rosie is doing okay. So let's come here and give her a treat. And uh, I was a little bit concerned about coming into this save with Rosie being here because there are a lot of reported issues of the pets disappearing from the household. So they get grayed out down here, but they haven't run away. They're just not there and you can like call them on the phone and they usually come back or or you can travel and then come back and they'll come back but they'll just randomly just disappear like people are watching their pet and then they'll just disappear watch it happen here but it hasn't yet <laughs> we're okay for now so let's come here and i'm gonna have him read some more from the fabrication book just because, and, uh, or actually, and after we, he does that, what we're going to do is we're going to try and see, we're not going to change our job, but we will not quit our job. We're going to find a job just to see whether it's registering our degree. Not that I'm planning on actually changing our job at this point in time. Because for one thing, I don't have the, the right aspiration up, though I could change that, but I don't really want to change it. I want to think about... I want to see what the options are, is all I'm really doing. Oh, there we go. He got to level three. So now he needs to fabricate five items. And I have a fabrication machine downstairs. And he has to have five dies. So in the basement, I added a fabrication machine. I didn't change the flooring down here at this point in time. Other than in the exercise room, I put the cork. Because that is considered to be eco-friendly. And so I was trying to look anywhere I could to try and add eco-friendly things without completely changing the house complete um, everywhere. So and then I added this water collector here, which gives you green. This gives you, I think this is supposed to give you an industrial, but I think it's only if it's on that it gives you the industrial. Like if you're using it, it adds to the industrial footprint. And the same with the regular fireplaces. So here, there's our bits and pieces that we have. So we can buy dyes right on here. But they're not cheap. Usually my sims dumpster dive and get them. But we don't have a dumpster. One, they take a lot of room. And two, if they don't have... I, I realize that if they don't actually have the trait that they like it, <laughs> then um, then they... <laughs> they don't... They, they get a bad mood lad from dumpster diving. <laughs> Go figure. <laughs> Which is what you'd expect. But yes, anyways, quite funny. So... He has read some of that and we're going to wait to see what his results are for his career. For his, like, what options are from his degree. So I'll be back once we get that pop-up. Okay, so here we have the pop-up for selecting a career. And I can't say that I'm noticing anything as being special. So I will look again after he gets his degree in the mail, which will be after his graduation ceremony tomorrow but uh it doesn't look like he has the option now to get a job that actually benefits from his degree but we're actually going to leave this part here thanks very much for watching and i'll see you next time bye this has been jennifer if you have any comments or suggestions please leave them below i'd love to see them if you like the video please leave a like and if you'd like to see more videos of challenge let's plays tutorials and occasional speed builds Please subscribe if you haven't already done so. Thanks very much.